Hello friends, welcome to our channel Mechanical Motivator. In this video, we are going to see job opportunities for chemical graduates, mechanical graduate, electronics graduate and E&I graduates. So all these department people can make use of this video. Nuclear fuel complex have now released an advertisement. I will be providing a link in the description. Once you click on the link, you will be directed to the official website of the company. This is the official website of the company. So when you scroll down, uh, you can see an advertisement for a link for click. Also, I will provide the link in the description for the advertisement. So once you click the link, uh, advertisement page will open. So government strive to have a workforce which reflects the gender balance and women candidates are to be encouraged to apply. So nuclear fuel complex is in Hyderabad and industrial establish establishment under the Department of Atomic Energy. Um, uh, is now inviting application for eligible candidate for the post of zirconium complex. So, various uh, job posting is there. See for postcode 12201, technical officer D, chemistry. So those who have uh, eligibility can apply. For uh, technical officer D, chemical. So, chemical graduates who have 60 percentage mark and you will be getting a salary of 60, 67,700. So, must be a citizen of India and maximum age will be 70. So, see for see here the technical officer D, mechanical group A, you will be getting a salary of 67,700, same 40 years, and uh, you must have B or B tech in mechanical. Same posting, uh, even for uh, electronics and uh, ENI people can also make use of it. So, you must pay an application fee of 500 to be paid in the form of demand draft drawn in favor of pay and accounts officer. And the selection procedure is selection of candidates will be based on the performance of the candidates in interview alone. However, screening tests may be conducted for eligible candidates in order to shortlist the number of candidates called for the interview. Candidates belonging to SCST category women ex servicemen are exempted from payment of application fee. Attested copy of certificate uh, to this effect should be attached uh, along with that. The general instructions are the posts advised uh, above are not uh, identified suitably for persons with disabilities and appointment to the post is subject to a medical examination. Upon selection and appointment, the candidate may be required to attend round-the-clock shift duties. The person working under central or state government, public sector undertaking autonomous body should submit no objection certificate. Candidate must possess the prescribed qualification from recognized university and departmental candidates who have uh, rendered not less than three years continuous regular service in central government and holding the post which are in the same line um, as on last date of application are eligible for relaxation in upper age limit. So candidates are required to download the application form which will be in website and you have to fill all your details and you have to send duly filled uh, application form to be sent. Uh, posted as application for post of technical officer D so whichever department you belonging to and a recent passport size photograph has to be uh, attached along with it and candidates are required to submit the following self-attested uh, documents along with the application so these are the documents to be submitted kindly make a note of it and duly filled application has to be sent to below address on or before uh, 11 3 2022 an application received beyond that date won't be accepted and will be considered as rejection if you feel this video is useful means kindly share the video to mechanical graduate electric uh, electronics graduate chemical graduate and graduates they will be making the best use of it kindly support our channel by subscribing and sharing the video to job seekers we will be bringing all job opportunities to your doorstep thanks for watching this video have a great day